Hello, welcome to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Tessa and I'm a stay-at-home wife who loves cleaning and cooking and talking about marriage. So if that's your type of vibe, do subscribe. And if you're a returning subscriber, welcome back. Thank you so much for the support. I really appreciate you. In today's video, we are cleaning the oven, guys. And as you know, I've moved, so I'm starting to deep clean everything. And I started with this oven. It was greasy, it was dirty, and so it had to be cleaned. So I grabbed this little brush and handy andy and water and I started scrubbing away. I was scrubbing and scrubbing. It wasn't really that hard to get some of the dirt off. I don't get how someone uh, leaves their oven so dirty and greasy like the people that used to live here did. Like, hello, clean once in a while. Anywho, so I was at least happy that some of the dirt came off and it was cleaner than it was when I began cleaning it by the time I finished. So I was happy about that at least. And so I continued to scrub. I tried removing that glass in my hands. I don't know what I was thinking because it's bolted onto the thing. So scrubbed, scrubbed and yeah the dirt was coming off but not all of it i'm probably gonna re re-scrub this oven when i get some scoring powder because it's not as clean as i wanted it to be however take a look closely how dirty it was look at this like you can see the handy andy has changed color and i used this white rug that i was going to throw away anyways because it was not going to be white after wiping down this oven like look at that if you know anything about me i'm like almost obsessive with this cleaning thing so when i find some of these things not coming off i was like Ugh yeah i'm going definitely going to get some scoring powder just to try and remove all the built-up grease that wasn't coming off and then i'll probably use some hot water to like really dissolve the grease the other challenge i faced with this oven was trying to clean between those two glasses because it's like two glasses but then there's like space in between them and yeah there's dirt between the glasses and i couldn't get my hand through the gap because it's not that big so uh, i was while i was wiping it down i was trying to think so how do i clean the other end of this glass I promise you whenever I build my own house and I have my own oven it's never going to be this dirty my kids are in trouble because they are gonna have to wipe down everything upon you I'm in a shower <laughs> so in the case of Ngakuti it's better I use one of my wooden cooking sticks to like try and navigate the cloth between the, the two glasses yeah it wasn't really a good plan because it kept slipping off i eventually ended up figuring out that you can actually unscrew one of the bolts and the one of the top glasses comes off but by the time i figured that out it was really dark and i didn't film it on camera anyways i did clean i did remove it and clean the glasses and they were so much cleaner after as you can see look at that look at that the oven is cleaner but you can see that all that piece i was talking about but the glass the glass was definitely way cleaner than it was and i was happy about the glass i see i will definitely do a second cleanup of the oven 
anyways thank you for watching do subscribe comment and i'll see you in the next one